What's going on, beautiful people? Welcome back to another Hall's Capital video. Uh, so in this video, guys, we are going to be starting our Terra Luna video series. And I have five projects that I want to share with you. Four of these are actually on testnet, and some of them are incentivized testnets, which means by playing with some free money, you have the opportunity to earn uh, some airdrops in the future when these governance tokens actually go live, all right? Now, what I want to do uh, before we actually jump into this video series, guys, I want to take a second and I just want to make sure you all understand how to set your wallets up for testnet, where to get the testnet tokens from, uh, and how to pay for transactions in the testnet. Uh, one thing that I have noticed when I was going in all of these discords to gather information uh, on these different projects, it seems like the communities don't know how to access uh, UST testnet tokens. Um, I would say at least for sure three of them uh, of the discords that I was in, majority of the people were saying, hey, I need UST testnet. Can someone send me some UST testnet tokens? I can't do um, the beta testing without it. I'm going to share with you guys how to get UST testnet. It's kind of shocking to me that the mods and the developers in the room wouldn't share uh, with the community how to do this. Um, but I want to make sure you guys understand how to do this. That way, when we jump into these next four videos, uh, we don't have to spend any time uh, going through faucets and testnets. I'm going to jump into the video and I'm just going to assume you already have your testnet tokens. So this is the video to learn how to do all of that. All right. So let's go ahead uh, and let's get set up over here. So first things first, you're going to want to go to faucet.terror.money. Uh, this is the Terra Luna faucet that I've given you before in previous videos. They will send you 10 Luna tokens on the testnet. Now you need to make sure that your wallet is set up on testnet. So to do that, come over to your Terra station, guys. You're going to go to this little cog at the top right corner and you're going to go from mainnet, click on testnet, and then you should see your wallet update with uh, that big words that say testnet. That way, you know, you're on the testnet. Now, what you need to do is you got to get some UST tokens in there. As you can see, I've got the 10 Luna, but I need UST to participate in swaps and on the testnet. Now to do that, this is just the way that I do it, guys. Um, and this always worked for me. This is how I always get UST tokens. Uh, all you would do, come over here and do the swap. Select the coin that you want to swap for. I want to swap for UST. Um, and then from here, all I would do is I'm going to need to change the fee that I'm going to be paying on this. So uh, give me a second. We'll do that. We're going to go ahead and update this information. All right. Let's see. Da, da, da. Everything looks good on there. We hit submit. Give it one second. And transaction successful. We have swapped some Luna for UST. And as you can see now, I have Luna and I've got some UST in the wallet. Uh, so let's refresh, give it a second. Uh, so everything pops up and there we go, guys. Got some Luna, got some UST. And you can see when I started this video, I had no UST. So it's just that simple, guys. Another way you can do this is if you come on over to the actual TerraSwap, uh, I don't know why it's not recognizing my wallet. Uh, Google Chrome always gives issues when I whenever I do testnet videos. Um, come on over to the TerraSwap, guys. If you go to swap, you go here, connect your wallet. Uh, you're going to do the same exact steps. You're going to come over to UST, find the UST that you want, and then change your fee to Luna. All right, that's all you have to do, guys. Change the fee to Luna. Now, if this is your main wallet, I would not recommend paying the fee in Luna. You're always better paying the fee in UST. But for the purpose of getting the testnet UST, change the fee to Luna. That way you can pay for the fees on the swap and then you can go ahead and get some UST or just swap it directly in the wallet. Uh, and that's it, guys. Real simple video. But I just wanted to make sure for everyone, because I know everyone's on different levels of crypto. Some of you guys just started with me this year. Some of you guys have been here for a year plus. Um, so again, you have a greater understanding than the newer people. But I want to make sure everyone knows how to get these testnet tokens. Um, now we're going to go ahead and we're going to jump into our next couple of videos in which I will go over the projects, um, the incentivized ones we're going to cover first, and then we'll go over the other ones that have not confirmed an incentive or an airdrop just yet. Guys, I hope this video was helpful and I'll catch you on the next one.